Hello and welcome to this short video in which I like to introduce you the OCAD sketch layer. The OCAD sketch layer can be opened by clicking on this icon and you get some more icons down there. The OCAD sketch layer and its tools are designed to be used for field work with a tablet computer and a pen. Whether you draw your maps in the terrain with a tablet or on paper is of course up to you. Working with a tablet has some compelling advantages like the use of uh, real-time GPS or also the possibility to open and manage different background maps. For my map I have loaded three different background maps as you see. For example an aerial image, a hill shading map and a vegetation based map. However, drawing on a tablet has not been very efficient so far. When working with paper, an object is rarely drawn in one piece. For example, if I'm standing here on this street, I maybe see the beginning of the thicket, but I can't see where it ends. So if I work with paper, I would just draw the beginning of this object and I would take notes as I go. In OCAD, there has not been any suitable tool for it so far. That's where the sketch layer now comes in. It offers you the same possibilities as sketching by hand, even more. You can choose different line width, different colors, and you also have the possibility to erase objects you have sketched. So if I'm standing here, I would choose a line width and maybe a green color for the thicket, and then I can start to sketch the beginning. Maybe I can choose a bit a wider width like this and then I walk around the thicket and I take further notes. If I'm not satisfied with my notes, as I said, I can also erase my object again And I can continue and finish my object like this. I can also switch between other OCAD symbols. For example, if I see a, a thicket here that is uh, very distinct and small, I can draw it directly with an OCAD symbol. And as I said, I have several tools here, several sketch width. I can draw on road down there. I can delete parts if I'm not satisfied, and so on. I also have the possibility to show and hide the sketch layer by clicking on this icon, and then my sketch layer is gone, and I can see it again. If I'm done with my sketch, I can uh, save my sketch as an uh, image and load it directly as background map. By clicking on this icon, I can check quickly and you see I have now loaded my sketch as a PNG file. So if I'm done, I can also delete all my sketch features, but there is no undo for this function, so be careful for it. But now I have saved my sketch as PNG file, so I can do that. That was it from this uh, short sketch layer introduction. More information can be found on our wiki and of course on our homepage. Thank you for watching and see you next time.